On Saturday, 2nd of May, the last of nine repatriation flights from Nepal left the airport. This is probably the last large repatriation flight and was organised by France. The French Embassy in Nepal proud today to organize this third charter flight to Paris. Today we have 303 passengers, including 110 French nationals. All the others are from more than 30 different countries. Hi, I'm Sonia. My name is Martin Boyo. I come from France. My name is Nora. I'm from Finland. Now I'm moving back to Europe. These flights have been remarkable in repatriating more than 2,300 citizens of all nationalities from uh, Nepal in this time of crisis with the coronavirus. And also when you're in a foreign country and you don't really know what's going to happen, what are the regulations, so it was sometimes a bit difficult, especially when there were many police and army in the streets. So, yeah, I'm feeling quite good to go back to Finland. Looking back, it is clear to me the German ambassador, the European Union works for all its citizens. And by the way, it also works for Nepal. 3,000 PCR coronavirus test kits donated by Germany were on board the French repatriation flight this Saturday. And they are badly needed in Nepal right now. This is sufficient European teamwork again. We are here actually for the fifth time now. We first organized four German repatriation flights and now working closely together with the colleagues from the French Embassy and the European Union. And uh, we are really grateful for this collaboration. Abroad, French countries and EU countries, we express our solidarity and we work all together, we cooperate uh, in order to uh, bring support to uh, foreign nationals. I want to thank uh, the Embassy of Finland and France and the European Union for organizing this flight. 